Hey everybody, it's May 11th, uh, nice day, some nice bushes. Uh, I ended up uh, getting some peas. I found uh, six of them at a, just our local place. So I'm going to do two of them in the dirt, as you just saw. Two of them in a Dutch bucket, which this guy's already sprouted up quite a bit. And I'm going to do two in a crap key bucket. And this is just, just the bucket, just with the nutrients in it. Uh, just cut up a pool noodle because I didn't have any uh, net cups for the right size. And so we'll do a little competition here. So far, I think these guys are already winning. Mint's doing good here. Uh, this does say cascade tomato, but I'm pretty sure this is a cucumber. <laughs> so something happened with the seeding, but I'm happy with more cucumbers because so, it looks uh, quite similar to that, I would say. More so than a tomato plant, which is already up past here. Uh, the first video two weeks ago, it was down here. So crazy growth. Oh. To take off some of these suckers so just in case you didn't know the sucker is right in the middle there and they just pop off and you can actually grow these you now just put it in water and it'll create a new one but this will help oh, there's another one here just clip those off and it'll have the branches out you just look after that like these guys can be taken off just put it in the big one the same as these guys here. This one's probably big enough that, that we can plant that guy. Some of the peppers are growing pretty good. This guy's got a little bud going in there. It's amazing how quickly they grow. peppers it's peas and I did put some uh, basil in here so it was just a cutting from a, a plant I had so just and that's always a good thing just if when if you're making pesto pasta or something take cut it off uh, and just keep the top few leaves on put it in water and then plant it I move the habanero pepper over. It's got cute little roots. So I moved him into just a cracky bucket. So it's just the nutrients again. And I have that's a matching one there. Bok choy is coming up. This one's flowered already. Look at the size of the Swiss chard. Crazy. And the arugula is flowered. I gotta look it up and I cut these off already so I kind of wanted to branch out. I gotta see if I do that right. Let's do the roots on this guy. That's <laughs> crazy. Looks like something was eating it. I'll have to watch that. Not sure what. They're from too hot. That's the peppers are going. And a bunch of little flowers there. These peas should take off quite a bit. Which is good. I love fresh peas. Flower there. Blue beans. All right, just a quick one today. Oh, we got the, uh, the the pepper in a beer can. 
he's getting happy. Swiss chard here, getting bigger. Might have some. Oh, it's, it's heavy. Yeah, good stuff. Can't wait to eat it all. Okay, that's it for this week. Just a quick one. Nice growth. Alright, thanks for watching.